Hello, hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to my five days of Christmas and today I'm sharing another really cute little uh, festive bake. So I have got um, some puff pastry. Before I start, can I please request you to go and subscribe? Just hit the button and don't forget to hit the bell button so you get a notification every time I share a video. Um, would love your support. Right, so I have got some cutoffs from my previous bake. So I've got some cut off puff pastry pieces, but you can use a fresh, uh, ready rolled puff pastry for this bake, or you can make your own at home. So I'm just going to flour some work surface, clean work surface, and I'm going to start by using these three different sizes of the star cookie so i've got a large i've got a medium and i've got a small and i'm going to cut out as many as i can from the amount of pastry i have left i think i've got enough for five little christmas trees now that I've got all the pieces, just give them an egg wash. Just brush them with some beaten egg and they'll go in a really nice hot oven at 190C uh, for 20, 22 minutes. But we'll keep a close eye because they will bake quite uh, quickly the little ones so we'll keep a close eye and then uh, once they are golden and ready we're going to get them out. Let them cool very slightly and I'm going to place uh, the biggest star at the bottom and I've got some Nutella here which I have um, kind of um, just warmed up in a microwave for 20 seconds so it's quite easy to spread. Just a little blob of Nutella on top, the second piece of star, some Nutella again and the third piece of star. And then you'll get these cute little mini Christmas trees, which you can prepare the day before. They will be so, so cute on your Christmas table. You can put them in the center on everyone's plates. Um, really good for New Year's. You can change the shape um, and make something else, but these look really nice. And I'm gonna finish them with some um, dusting of icing sugar. Hope you've liked my recipe um, leave me a comment a thumbs up if you've liked the recipe don't forget to subscribe and I will see you again for another recipe very soon 